Hi. Before I get started, I want to mention that it's best to run the Rockworks program with two monitors. A single monitor, or a projector, can be kind of cumbersome. The only time I ever use it is if I'm uh, in a hotel room or on a flight, but at home and in the office, I'm always using two monitors. Now, for the sake of this video, obviously, we're going to be using one monitor. Now, the Rockworks program consists of five levels. There's the first level, which is this one, um, level one, which is um, basically the Earth apps, which are a collection of programs that work in conjunction with Google Earth or to create uh, diagrams within Google Earth as well as pulling data out of Google Earth. The second level is call, is um, includes the Rockworks Utilities, which are a series of programs for reading data from flat files or spreadsheets, um, such as this one here, and then taking that data and producing some sort of diagram, such as this uh, Stereonet, uh, here's a rose diagram, a simple contour map, a, uh, a block model made from XYZ G data, a Piper diagram, and so on. The third level or level three of, the, of Rockworks, includes the ability to plot logs, cross-sections, three-dimensional log diagrams, and these programs use a relational database called the Borehole Manager, which looks quite a bit different than, here, here are the utilities with a spreadsheet, and over here are, is the Borehole Manager. You toggle between the two, and so it's quite a bit different. One, one's a relational database, One's just a two-dimensional or a flat uh, file like a spreadsheet. The, fifth le the fourth level within Rockworks includes the ability to produce um, basically models based on the borehole data. Now you could make a lot of these models within the utilities if you were willing to calculate the XYZ coordinates and do a bunch of other gymnastics, but trust me, um, if you've got borehole data, you're better off with level four. And then finally, level five, which we'll talk about in, a, in an advanced section of this class, will come much later on. And that's um, where we include the ability to process the data on a batch level, meaning that you can bypass all of these menus up here. And um, uh, But like I say, we'll be talking about that later on. Uh, level five also includes the ability to, do, um, to use an SQL database rather than the native database, which is MDB or the same thing as the Microsoft Access Engine.